So, recently, a new case of a brutal killing of a black named John Alberto Silvera Frias at the hands of two white security guards outside the supermarket has sparked outrage across Brazil. The 40-year-old was repeatedly punched in the face on Thursday, and protests have been since ta been taking place across the country. It has emerged that one of the guards was an off-duty military police officer, and both have been arrested, reports BBC. A black man who died while being beaten by supermarket police security guards was buried on Saturday, following protests that echoed those of the racial justice movement in the United States. The man, a father of four, was buried in a white t-shirt in a coffin draped with the flag of his favorite soccer team in the city of Porto Alguiri. And a woman protested against racism after John Alberto Silveria Freiras was beaten to death by security guards at the Care for Supermarket in Porto Elguera, Brazil, November 2020. Sign reads Black Lives Matter and Demand Justice for Beto. Some protests carried Saturday. Military police used pepper spray to disperse demonstrations outside Recife. This is not only one case where a black was killed with no reason. Like in 2020, a man fell asleep in his car, blocking the drive through lane at a fast food restaurant, and then was killed by police. And then in 2020, a man named George e. Floyd was killed because he didn't pay money to this shopkeeper. But actually, he gave money. But the shopkeeper said it was fake money. And then the shopkeeper called the police. The police choked Floyd and with his knees to the ground. But later, Floyd died due to, due to suffocation. Floyd was black. That's why the po the two police were white. So they choked him to the death. Then, another case in 2020. Near Lucy, a girl was killed because she and Kenneth Walker were sleeping when three plain coat officers arrived at the apartment to execute a search warrant in a drug case. They believed it was a break-in. And Walker called 911 and fired his licensed firearm. Tyler, the girl, who was unarmed, was shot eight times. And then, another case in 2019 near Miami. A lady was killed by a police officer. She was shot, killed through the window of her home in the presence of her a of her eight-year-old nephew. The police were responding to a call from a neighborhood who reported that Jennifer's son, the lady, front door has been left open. And then, another shocking case of a black in 2018 near California. The boy was standing in his grandmother's backyard. Officers believed that Clark, the boy, was holding a gun. And they shot Clark more than 20 times. And later, the officers knew that he was just holding his mobile.
So there are many cases exactly same where there was no justice, where humanity was not there, where there but there was racism in these cases. It will take me hours to repeat all those cases where there was racism between humans, people. And all the cases which, have re which I repeated, the people who were killed were all blacks. And, the, and who killed the people were white. So, there is racism and why people are like just, just like they are just putting people, they are just separating them. Like these are blacks and these are whites. And that's why they are killing many innocents. So, that's all for this video. Our social media link is given in the description, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. All the links are given in the description so you can go and check that out. And even our website www.find.com, the link is given in the description, you can go and check that out. And so, that's all for this video. This is my report in Hyderabad and you're seeing VM2.